Hey there, everybody. Thet here, and welcome back to Thet Plays Jurassic World Evolution. We're here with a Struthio Mimus meeting, as you can see. They're all getting along. Telling secrets, probably talk about how much of a jerk I am. And now it's raining on them. How's that for your parade? Anyway, we got to get a new genome up to uh, 75%, which means we got expeditions to do. Yes, we do. Let's see. Most of these are partially depleted here, but uh, we can go ahead and maybe learn some more about a couple of these folks. Do we have new fossils to go after here? No, we do not yet, so we definitely need to get that done. All right, but I believe we did get a new dinosaur. Yes, we do got the Dracorex. He's got some attack power on him. Don't get it twisted. And that poor Youngosaurus didn't stand a chance. No wonder. Look at these stats. 49-18 versus 76-25. Dude didn't stand any chance at all. Been better off sending a Triceratops after him. I don't think that's how I should be making dinosaurs. But then again, you know, if I want to give him some free food, just throw some Struthiomimuses their way. Totally give them some free food here. I might make them another dinosaur, though, to, like, take on. You know what? Let's... No, I don't want to give them a Dracorex. Let's see. They're herbivores as well. Got a pretty short lifespan on them. 47. Dude, the shopping is just off the chain right now. 68, 73, 69. First of all, nice. 65. Yeah, wow, these Dracorexes do not live long. Can we fix that? Can we get up their rating with a nice uh, arid pattern? Whew. None of these increase their lifespan, though. We can make them tougher, but, you know, we can make them better fighters. Sure. I don't know if that does much for us. You know, I could totally do that for the... Uh... You know, I didn't modify the Youngosaurus at all. I wonder if I could make it better competition. Let's give it the savanna gene. Yeah, we could totally up its stats a bit. Make it more aggressive. Does decrease viability. Hmm. Maybe we should just give it more defense in general. Nah, we'll just make it more aggressive. I like that. Incubate one more right here. Chompy, how you doing? Health's at 100 again. So he's perfectly healthy, as you can see. Probably need to go ahead and get those puppies filled back up here. Attending to feeder supply. Go ahead and fill these up. And you know what? We got a third ranger team. We might as well make use of it. Acknowledging request for feeder resupply. There we go. Got more fossils. Let's go here. I want to get that Ankylosaurus up and running here soon. Speaking of which, Corythosaurus. We don't have any DNA for it yet. So, nice to get that going. Research Center needs research to get done. I guess more fossil space is fine. Doesn't really do that much for us. I'd love to have some Upgrades for this. But not yet. Actually, we had an up a research center at Isla Muerte. We could totally increase dig speed. Apparently that's what I need. So I tell you what, let's get this let's get this genome taken care of, and then we can go ahead and worry about that. How you doing in Montasaurus 6? You looking good. Looking like you're having a good time over there. Alright. You. You just not genetically modified beast of a creature. First of all, looking good. Loving the skin pattern on you. Looking quite nice. Oh, he's panicking a bit. He's like, oh, that's not good. I don't want to mess with that yet. And he's like, oh, but I might want to mess with you. And he's changed his mind. He's like, I don't want to mess with you. Not yet. Dude is not happy with his social skills right now. Or social stats, I should say. Could use more population. So you know what? 
Let's see if we can give them a numbers advantage. Looks like for the, um... Ceratosauruses, two is the magic number, because it looks like any more would increase the... Ooh. The social a little bit much. Oh. Oh, they've, they've begun. I should have totally taken that mission to make creatures fight and win twice because it looks like Chompy's got this, man. Ooh. Oh, wow. That was a big hit. But he's about to fight back. Oh. Let me tell you how mad I am. Here he goes. Oh, Hatchling was too weak to survive. Ouch! A big bite. What are you gonna do, Hyangosaurus? You gonna fight back? Chompy's old, man. You got a chance. If he was in his prime, you'd be dead already. Wait, are you done fighting? Did you actually quit? You actually stopped fighting? You mean they don't always fight to the death? Or maybe they do. Oh, Chompy, he's, he's looking at him again. Oh, he's back up to half health. Oh, yep, they're going for round two. Oh, you thought... You thought you were done. Dude. I think you've done it. Oh, yes, he is. He's done it. Ooh. That was not a good sound. Well, one of them failed to incubate. The other one's good to go. I don't know if this actually brings down animal welfare or dinosaur welfare or not. I would imagine it would, but I mean, it's... It's a circle of life, right? This is what happens. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he just saw Chompy eating this other Yongosaurus out there and he just... That, that sound meant... Oh, crap. Oh. Hi, how you all doing? You don't want to... I mean, you'll be okay with Chompy. Chompy's not going to do anything, do you? But uh, this other guy might. And actually, it was not my intention to have them fight. So, uh, you know what? Pick on someone your own size, dudes. Ooh. Alright. Chompy's over there healing. Hey, research complete. Inventory space. Nice. Let's get some more research done. Next. Eh, let's do scheduling, eh? Yeah, more tasks for the ACUs. That's nice. Fossil Center gives us ooh, plenty of fossils to look at. Ankylosaurus, sweet. Triceratops genome. A couple of things to sell. Seems like a fairly successful dig. Oh my god, you killed it too? Dude! I just released these things. These freaking dinosaurs are hangry, man. Yo, where's Chompy? Oh, there he is. He's healing up. He's going to be fine, probably. Yeah, he's going to be fine. Oh, the Ankylosaurus is out. Sweet. And by out, I mean I can make them. Get another expedition. You know what? Before we get another expedition going, can we go ahead and get another contract going from the science division, please. The science division is always on the lookout. For oh, that's easy. Improve our bottom line. Do that thing you were gonna do already. Okay, cool. I'll do that. Bam, done. All right, you guys think he's so tough? Say hello to the top gang. The Triceratops, that is. Yeah, that just meant don't pick on me. All right. And they can share this one feeder. From what I've seen, one feeder is actually more than enough for all of them. Like, these guys will never go hungry. I can guarantee it. Their social seems to be high enough, too. Population could be closer to the middle, but they're happy with what they got. Social over here seems to be pretty good for everyone as well. Yeah, even these boys have plenty of social things to do. 
opportunity has presented itself. Ran any power outages for 10 continuous minutes. I could probably do that. I don't like it when the power goes out. I don't either. Wait, they... Oh, no, no. I got it. Are you serious? You two began... Oh, jeez. I didn't expect them to actually start fighting. Quick. There's only one thing to do. I gotta get a picture. <laughs> the, the other two started fighting, too. All of the dinosaurs are fighting. Quick. Get over to the fence. Woo! Oh, the one in the back was finishing a fight. Wow. Look, I got priorities, okay? This might not be great art, but I like it. Wow. Whoa! The Triceratops won! Uh, Holy crap, that was brutal. Wow. I... I seriously did not expect that to happen. Holy crap. I did not think this would end up being a Triceratops pen. Wow. Uh... So I gotta give the Ceratosaurus some more defense, I think. Wow. What do they got on them right now? Some resilience and lifespan. I mean, I do like the lifespan, but wow, jeez. Yes, this is exactly what we needed. Well done completing that contract. Thank you. Yeah, more defense for them. Oh my god. I did not expect both of them to get bodied like that. Jeez. Transporting asset. I am asset genuinely shocked. A couple of low quality Ankylosaurus fossils. Not exactly my idea of a good time, but okay. Wow. <laughs> Let's head back there. That was quite shocking. All right, a couple of ranger station upgrades to go, and we'll be done there. Obviously, I have to apply the upgrades for them to be worth anything, which I have not been doing very much of. But, uh, you know, I can get outage protection and improved output over here. I'm actually really good on power, I think. Yeah, available power 44. Not bad at all, to be honest with you. Yeah, the entertainment division don't like me very much right now. That's okay, though. You know, I could totally increase the success rate over here. There we go. Incubation speed as well? Sure. That should help. There we go. And this one doesn't really need anything right now. Yeah, I don't think I need anything for this lab. This lab's fine as long as we don't lose. But we will eventually lose a Triceratops, likely, so you know what? Get me some uh, success rate upgrades so we can put some more in its place in case things get really bad. Still got 34 to go. What else can be upgraded around here? No, don't do that. Let's try that again. Come on, the uh, success rate here. T extra 20% because this place rocks. Let's go. ACU Center could use some upgrades now. It could upgrade the reload speed or accuracy. Upgrade accuracy. Apparently this place can... Oh, and scheduling too. Yeah, let's upgrade that. Wow, you can throw scheduling on multiple... Ooh, another dead dino? Who dis? A Struthiomimus died. I mean, there's not much we could do about that. I can almost guarantee it went out of old age. Collecting asset. All right. Well, in that case, let's throw down, let's throw down two incubation speeds and one success rate on this one. Get those things replaced. Yeah, ninety-three percent success chance. 
98% pure genome. Look, we are just the kings of Struthiomimus town at this point. One goes away, two take its place. This is how the world works for Struthiomimus. You could actually make some more of any creature in this pen. The only one that was fairly antisocial was the Triceratops. And we dealt with that. The best way we know how. By uh, moving them to another pen. Hey, it worked, right? Don't give me that jazz as if it didn't. All right. Nice Dracorex. Ooh, a good Ankylosaurus fossil. Nicely done. InGen database has some stuff in it. In case you want to read. Two more Struthiomimuses coming out. How you doing, buddy? Ranger reload speed research is complete. Hey there, pal. Population goes up a little bit. Social's doing just fine. I like how the herbivores all just... They just get along. They just like each other. What's not the love? Right, we're going to wait till both ceratosauruses are done before we uh, bring them out here. Because these boys, these Triceratopses, they don't fool around, so we've learned. We should be safe from power outages. Like, if that happens, I'm going to be quite disappointed, mostly in myself. We also don't really need the emergency shelter, but, you know, it is what it is, and that's all that it is. Let's see, we don't need any of these. We don't really need any of these either, although we could always just put another gift shop over here just because. But we already got one really close by. So I feel like that would be infringing on the other one's territory, you know? I think that's I think that's a faux pas. Although I could be wrong. So yeah, there's not too much else to build over here per se. Let's see. Yeah, keep keep digging in this one. This one I like. This one has good stuff for us, from what I've seen. Our Reacher Search Center has no upgrades, but there's no upgrades to give it. I think everything else... Well, no, the Fossil Center. Extraction speed. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude, why have I not had that all this time? The Expedition Center. Can't upgrade those yet. So I need to get a research station over at the other spot. Come on. Come on, baby. All right. It's the one thing we can't control and have to accept about these creatures. Ooh. Some of them have the instinct to kill. Hi, pretty. How you doing? Yep, they do have that killer instinct. Alright, try not to get too fancy about the whole killing each other thing, okay? I'm gonna actually keep making some more behind this. I bet I can't unlock these yet. We'll get there, though. Come on, close the gate so I can incubate a new one. There we go. Should probably get some more DNA for them, guys. So I can make some better ones. Anyway, how's the park doing? Four and a half stars. I guess you could just use some more dinosaurs. That's the only thing that's not green so far. Combat infamy. That's actually a good score. Modifications, authenticity, base rating. Research done, variety penalty. I know you could get a penalty for that. We almost... We over 1,500 guests. All right, I get that. Don't worry about it. Let's replace it. That's how we do. All the research is done for now. All that we can do. So I got nothing to worry about on that front. It's like our fossil expedition is coming back too. Yeah, just get some food, man. You don't need to go out hunting things all the time. Go ahead and get you boys back out. You know what? Let's get some of that Ceratosaurus fossil. Get that boy going. 
Very low quality Dracorex fossils, huh? Not my idea of a good time either. I'm thinking over here should probably just throw a little bit of water. If we can fit it. Might not be able to. But I'm thinking nowhere to put water over here, huh? Hmm. Reliable power makes this whole place work. We get rid of this. And you taking on that contract? Well, that was some smooth action on your part as well. Well, thank you. Okay, let's see if we can add a little bit of water here now. Still know where we can add it, huh? What is this terrain constraints, bull monkey? Look, flatten this stuff out. How about we lower some of it? What if we lowered? Ah, that's what they mean by terrain constraints. Look at that. Look at this. It's nuts. Also, it looks hideous now. Smooth that crap out. Okay. I wanted to give them some water, like, on this side, so they could have their own... There we go. Their own pool of water. There we go. See? You've done good work in the past. That's why I know you are perfect for this contract. Thank you. Yeah, they're good on water. Everyone seems to be fine. You fine with the amount of force and everything? Yep, good on water. Okay, cool. Right now you're doing all... Oh! I thought something was going to happen there. Well, we just got rid of one of the feeders. And there's still the goat feeder, so we should be fine. Do have to refill these, though, so... Proceeding to the feeder now. Thank you. How's, how are these feeders doing? Fresh. Cool. Is there like a feeder thing over here? There's food. I can see where people are. There's a slight demand for food at this one spot. Actually, there's a high demand for food over here near, near the hotel. We should probably get food over there then and drink. Low demand for shopping everywhere. High demand for fun right here. Yep, there's fighting. Transport. They want shorter journeys from the arrival point? Well, I mean, it's a little late for that. Yeah, they've, uh... They've started going at it again. They're within visibility, though, right? Yeah, as long as they're fighting where we can see them. That's fine. Ish. Ugh, now they're both fighting again already. Oy vey. Well, eventually it'll be the Stratosaurus pen again, and I can... Kind of let them go with that. All right. Bring in some friends. One more should be fine. It might set them a little high on the... On the social here. But I assume... This may not end well for one or two of these animals, so... You know how it is. Anyway. We apparently need more food and drink at some of these areas. So I tell you what, when it comes to the people, you gotta give them what they want. Not what they think they want, but what they want. Because they're kinda, they're kinda derpy when it comes to what they think they want. I feel like I should be able to build there. I feel like I should. Anyway, I, you know what I can do? I can remove some of the water over here. Make just enough space. There you go. And then we can just fill it back up with water. As much of it as we're allowed to. And I said add water. Whoa, what have we what have we done? What have we done? Water up as much of this area as we can. Okay. And then I guess this stuff will, uh, will smooth out. We'll shove some trees on it. Cool. <laughs> oh, got another dead dino over here. Please tell me. It was a Triceratops, which is kind of what I'm looking for. Sad to say. <laughs> I feel like we need another live bait feeder over here now. Although less efficient nutrient delivery than the carnivore feeder, it satisfies food and provides activity for the hunter. In other words, everyone loves it. There we go. 
Whoop, wow, another fight already, huh? You guys just don't slow down, do you? Alright, and you need food too? I mean, you have a slight need for food. This takes care of this hotel. So that's good. This place has no fun? Fun buildings. Fun buildings are supposedly shaded. Wait. But I don't understand what counts as a fun building. Help! <laughs> I'm lost. You got a food place right next to you. I'm not helping you out anymore. You got what you need. It's trying to sell me up the river at this point. Get that Triceratops out of there. Alright, get me more Ceratosaurus. Get me more Fossil Center. Oh, yeah. Oh, that'll bring us up the 75 Genome, which will take care of that other contract. Beautiful. Now we just need to reach higher profits. Is shopping fun? Gift shop is fun. Apparently the gift shop is fun. So if we throw another gift shop over here, people will have fun. Presumably they will also spend more money. It's a, kind of a win-win. What's this gift shop over here selling? This one's selling lunch boxes, so this one over here is going to sell them night vision goggles. Look, you know you didn't have to prove anything. But the way you took charge left an impression. Good work. Thanks, I guess. I appreciate the support. Alrighty. Almost done with this gift shop. Come on, I want to get this thing all settled up. So the other one just decided to stop fighting? There's another one in here, right? Hey, don't get fancy. You're injured. You don't want to get fancy right now. I don't know. Either way, gift shop seven. Yo, night vision goggles. Cost 20 bucks. I'm gonna sell them for 50. Because you know we're gonna make some money. Yo. Make it about fun, okay? That's apparently what we need right now is fun. There you go. Now they got fun all over the place. Fun rating 100%. How is food and drink rating 90? What if we have you serve something better? Dude, make us a feast. Sell it for 25 bucks. You're almost at capacity. Well, add a staff member. There you go. Management, concentrate on food. Yeah. Drink is good. Yeah. See, now now we're talking. I don't think that actually does what I think it does. Anyway, there you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. So this place also needs to be rocking out them dino feast for 25 bucks with two staff. Oh, geez. It was full anyway. Yeah, it definitely needed more staff. Woo, we were losing money there for nothing. What losers we were. 96%? Look, I'm not I'm not going for perfection here. Although I am going for that transport rating of 69%. That's just nice. Could use more shelter, apparently, too. Did I... Did you... No, you, you were... I think you were the other one. You did not make it out. Okay. Whoops. It's a slight whoops. I guess another hotel would not be out of the question. Since more visitors means more muns. So, I don't know. Where does hotel number three go? You want to sleep with the next to the Triceratopses? I actually want to. I would actually want to go ahead and go around this area a bit more. In fact, I could loop around the park. My dude, why have we not done this yet? In fact, this should be a big pat. Yeah, replace this. Oh, I can't replace it with the big chub. Okay. Asset in transit. All right. Replace this. 
Is this still connected? It is. Okay. Replace that with the big chub. Actually, you know what? Let's do a big fancy chub. Nah. Big chub. There you go. We're going to use this to actually go around the entire park. You know what? I don't want to go from there. I wanted to go from here. Yeah, this is where I wanted to go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You don't understand. We are drawing our perimeter, baby. Look, who doesn't like a nice little freaking walk around the park? It's literally an activity people do, okay? So don't even start with me about how you think this is a waste of money. I will fight you. I will probably lose, but we'll fight you nonetheless. Check out my S that I have inadvertently drawn here. Oh boy. What have I what have I actually done? Oh god. There we go. Just go straight. Go straight through this. Just power through. Pretend it's a good thing. Connect it to I don't know. Actually keep going up. Keep going up. Connect it there. Ha 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 ha. Yes. Now we have a walk around the park. Now we have a place we can put a second hotel. Kind of. Boom. That probably doesn't have power. It might. It might be just close enough. And it's not going to have any... Yeah, we're going to need power over here. Let's not even pretend we won't, okay? I need a substation, please. Let's put it... Put it on back. How much extra power do we have to play with? One. Alright, we're gonna need another uh, power station as well. Anyway, another hotel means we can get the profit per minute up. They praise the drinking facilities. So this is now Carnivore Island again. Thankfully. Let's not argue over the small stuff. Looking at the big picture, this is a solid contract. Yeah, yeah, fine, fine. Go get more. Start doing the stuff on these. Give me that Ceratosaurus fossil up as high as we can. Yeah, now we can start building stuff over here. I could also make another enclosure for other animals, but I kind of like the big herbivore island over here. Like herbivore world. And then carnivore land, and then, you know, the Triceratops, uh, temple. I don't know. It's a nice spot, is what I'm trying to say. And look, we got this going all the way around. We got trash cans. What more do you need? For your comfort, we've increased the hotel capacity of the island. You darn right it was for their comfort. Smooth out this road a bit. There you go. Much better. Okay. Beautiful. So, what do we need now? We need another power station. I feel like we just uh, shove that anywhere it can fit. I'm actually surprised it doesn't fit over here. And not in a happy way. Oh, 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 oh. I can put another one over here, though. This actually works. Bam. So easy, it's ridiculous. Where's your freaking... There you go. Now, I kind of hoping that tree would stay there, but whatever. There you go. Actually, you know what? I could have power... I could have upgraded this station instead. Probably would have been a smarter thing. Can you actually see, like, outage chance or anything? Not really. It's fine. There you go. This place probably doesn't have anything that it needs right now. No food, no drink, no fun. No way. So we're going to fix that. I'm going to give you a gift shop. Yes, we are. We're going to give you a fast food joint. Oh, that can fit over here too. Yes, it can. Boom. Boom. We're going to give you a clothing the shop. Opportunity comes with risks. For now, you've done the first. That is a job well done. 
Thanks. I actually don't know what I did that time. All I know right now is that I'm going a little bit over time, so, uh, you could do me this favor and let this clothing shop go in here. I would much appreciate it. How do we have terrain constraints? I would like to speak to your manager about these constraints. Whatever. Give me a new substation. Slap it right here. Connect it to that one. Everything will be powered. Gift shop. Gonna sell me some Barbasol. We're gonna do it at, uh, ooh, not that much. We'll Ten bucks doesn't make a profit. Fourteen bucks, then. Alright. Fast food place. Let's go with Dino Dishes. Nah, actually, you know, let's go with the Feast. The Feast for 25 seems to be making us some good money. There you go. In the clothes shop. Bada bing, bada boom. You know what? Hats are good. Hats are fine. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Profit? I mean... Profit's a little iffy across all places. It's not wonderful, but it's not bad. So I'm not really complaining yet. We'll complain later. As we try to get our profits per minute up. Anyway, that is going to be it for this episode of that plays Jurassic World Evolution. As always, it went over a little long, but that's all right, because it's good to play, and it's a lot of fun. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure to let me know by giving a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. You know how it works. You know how it do. You know how the Ceratosaurus have taken over the zoo once again. Like, what is this plant? Get this out of here. I ain't no vegan. Give me that jazz. Thank you again for watching this episode of That Plays. Jurassic World Evolution. My name is Thet, and I'll see you in the next video.